you go on the internet right now, say what is trending, say what me here, and it's all because of some video be that is going around. Some people are debating that it's not say what. Some people are saying that it is say what. But then the person, the man in the video, no, has come out to reply, and his reply went to say what. So that means the video, no, it is indeed say what who is in the video, not her look alike. What is the man saying? What was the whole issue? Is there an issue of blackmailing? What is going on? I have the food just for you. I'm the headless YouTuber and there's headless reactions. I'll try it. Yanko! This video started circulating yesterday. At first, it was just a screenshot, like a picture of a lady who looks like Sewami here and a man behind her. Now, when the, the picture came out, some people were saying that, no, no, it can't be Sewa. We know Sewa be here. This cannot be here. But then, people were looking for who the man is. Now, you remember somewhere 2019, there was this big wedding. It trended all over. Henry and uh, Dela. Henry. Henry 2019. Hashtag. Henry 2019. It happened at Royal Saint. A very, very big wedding. There was a boat that brought the groom and the bride. There was some horse riding in there. Kofi Mole performed. Kofiata performed. Kwabna Kwabna performed. She said it was a very big wedding. Very, very big. It trended in 2019. It, the man, no, Henry. Yes, Henry Fitz. The man who has been identified in the video, the Sewa Mihe video, no. That is him. In the wedding, Sewa Mihe and Nana Banamwa were present at that wedding in 2019. Put that one in your kotoje. We'll come back. Now, years later, we started hearing news that um, Henry and his wife, Delano, they've broken up. The lady is very sick now, but that one, you know, is somebody's family issue. So let's push that one aside. This video that started coming out, you know, three big rumors started spreading around this video. Now, when the video came out, they were saying that Henry is a very rich guy, and Sewami here was dating him, and they were a boyfriend, girlfriend, even before the wedding. But then later, people who know Henry personally started saying on the timeline and on internet that, this Henry man was very, very rich. That's why his wedding was that big. Spraying money. He bought a car for his wife. They, all these musicians came to perform. The wedding was at Royal St. Once upon a time, the biggest wedding in Ghana. Trending. But currently, there, he has gone through some kind of things. And he is not as rich as he used to be. Some people are saying that now he is broke. But maybe I'll say he is not as rich as he used to be. And because of that, you know, the three rumors that were spreading about this whole Sewa tape that is going around. You know, this is the first rumor. After that, I'll tell you the second rumor. And then I'll tell you what the man has come to reply on Snapchat. The first rumor is that his wife saw the video. His wife found this video of he and Sewa Mihe. His wife found it. And because of that, there was some entawantawa in the marriage. And then the marriage you know, grew like the marriage broke up. But then still, his wife was blackmailing Sewa that give me money, otherwise I'll post the picture, I'll post the video, I'll leak it. So according to the rumor number one, Sewa was paying. Sewa has been paying. But then it got to a point where Sewa didn't pay anymore and because of that, the woman leaked it. This is rumor number one. Now before we get to rumor number two, if you're sending money from the USA, UK or Canada to Ghana, use Lemfi. Lemfi is the best app because it comes with no charges, no transfer fee. And also the dollar rate, you know, the exchange rate is very, very good. So you can send money without thinking about inflation and all the dollar rate changes. Also, you can use my promo code HEADLESS and you'll get $30 cash back on your first $100 transaction that you do. So yes. Use the Lemfi app. You can go to Google Play Store or Apple App Store. You can download the app over there. Use the promo code HEADLESS and you get amazing things from Lemfi. And Afian Twasso. Now, rumor number two suggests that it is the Fitz, you no, know, Henry Fitz himself, who is blackmailing Sewa. That, you know, according to the rumor number two, you no, know, they did this video when they were dating. And then, for some time now, because Henry is not as rich as he used to be, he has been blackmailing Sewa. And Sewa has been paying, paying, paying. But then it got to a point where Sewa said, no, I can't pay anymore. And because of that, Henry has nicodemously leaked the video, and this is rumor number two, that Henry was blackmailing Sewa. 
and because Sewa didn't pay, now Henry has leaked it. There's this guy on TikTok called Benpa. Benpa also did a video, and according to him, no, he said he spoke to Sewa, and this is what Sewa told him, which was somewhere in line with rumor number two, that it was Henry who has been blackmailing Sewa, but because Sewa doesn't want to pay again, now he has gone to release the, the video. And because of that, you know, Ben Park is saying that if Sewa Mihe does not sue Henry, then it's not him. Watch this video. Ebusia, it should be trendy. I'm going to be bringing it to you. The video will be circulating. And yes, Sewa is here. Many Sewa are here personally. Many Ben Park are here. 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 Many Ben Park video na aba out no ne ex boyfriend na oni na date pen a oni ni ni ho biem e na bra no ye friend henry en kan na o tie wanya ne ho tam wanya ne ho obi nso ne bag oni en chechire ma me ye ni henry tie me ne tie ni ye kwasese na wadi ye no say wa am here at ho e na wo henry wo din sa video yi time ma na oni ni date e na mo ye sa video yi to ho as lovers say wa hwe ma mo ye ye na sa na oni na gai na sa o dia di we blackmail no Udi black melin ni biya utia. Na osu on tia biye ma nasi den yon. Henry. Nasi den yon. Sewa wen si wukura me. Bempa. Sewa amen kasana nu biye. Mm. Bayana ubi yemen su menfa on. Miyana minu ya baane sewa. Now this whole thing going around. Note that officially sewa mi he has not said anything about this whole thing. She has not posted about it. She has not commented. Publicly commented to clear her name or whatever. She is posting random things on the internet. And people are in the comment section asking her that, is it you, is it not you, is it you, is it not you? But then this video from Ben Pano, I'm sure this is what Henry Fitz has seen. And now Henry Fitz is angry that, ah, why is Sewami here telling people that me, I was blackmailing her? And because of that, an angry, he has gone to post on Snapchat. This is the first thing that he said. He said, wow and wow again, blackmailing you since 2019? When I was accommodating you for 2,500 daily for about 5 months? Hey, then this guy, 2019, he had money power. Accommodating somebody for 2,500 Ghana CD a day for 5 months. Let's do the quick calculation. 2,500 a day. 2 days will be 5,000. That means 30 days will be 75,000 Ghana CDs. So one month, this guy was paying 75,000 Ghana CDs. Just to entertain Sewa Mihe. So that means five months will be 375,000 Ghana cities. Oja, oja, oja. Just to entertain or accommodate somebody. Yan Twasso. Or say, let's not even talk about how much I was spending on other bullshit, including your fake ass pregnancy miscarriage. Which I say, maybe Sewa did a bill him, say. I'm pregnant, nene. <laughs> Twasso, I did not even have this so-called video until you sent it to me to calm me down after you screwed up and I left your ass. You took the video, messed up, and it got into the wrong hands. Now, Mr. Man, video, no, that's not how to spell video. But anyway, maybe you're angry. So we'll pardon you over there. So according to Henry Fitz, Sewa was the one who took the video. And if you watch the video truly, it was Sewa who took the video. He, yeah, he was, you know, doing mwah, 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 on the back of Sewa, and Sewa was the one taking the video. So according to this, that means Sewa took the video. The video was on Sewa's phone. And Sewa was the one who sent it to Henry to cheer him up because probably Sewa messed up. Okay, maybe they were having relationship issues, and Sewa sent it that, baby, look at this. We were so happy back then, you know, that kind of lovers, lovers thing. No? Yeah, uncle. Or say, explain to them how you left a particular iPhone in your car on a and then in 1624. Or say, in a, explain how you left a particular iPhone in your car. God knows what and what have been hiding on that iPhone. Don't you think you screwed up and the contents got into the hands of numerous men whose toes you stepped on? Nature say, Sewa has a particular iPhone that maybe there are things on it. Videos of, you know, intimate moments. And she mistakenly left it in a certain car. And somebody has gotten hold of it. <laughs> Nature say, if that is true, yeah, then we are in for a lot of, you know, content. And then he posted again, he said, Sewa, 
Next time, I will come very hard and I will bury every reputation you have built. Calling me a blackmailer, do not make a vex. Now this alone shows that it is true. It is Sewami here in the video. Because people were in denial that it's not her. Because I, the way Sewa is, uh, I don't think she would, have, you know, she would go, she would lose God like that and then take a video of intimate moments. Knowing very well how these things do to people's reputation. So people were saying that it can't be Sewa. But from this, you know, it means it's indeed Sewa. So that means they were having some, I don't, I don't know if it was official relationship or they were having a situation ship or they were having you there host me and pay me and let's do the thing. But paying 375,000 Ghana cities for five months is a very wild thing. <laughs> People are cashing out in a car. You that are watching this, if you go to that guy's house, how much does he give you? <laughs> and how much does he give you? Anyway, so this is what is going on. The leak in India now it is confirmed that it is Sewa. And Henry Fitz has also come out to say that don't call me a blackmailer because I have not blackmailed you. You took the video, you sent it to me when we were having issues. So I don't know how you got the video out there. You have gone to leave your phone somewhere and somebody has found your phone and the person has seen all these contents on your phone. <laughs> Share your views in the comment section. Let me know what you think about this and please. No matter how in love you think you are, don't take videos of your intimate moments. Don't even take the video and delete it. Don't take the video at all. Leave your phone and enjoy yourself because you never know what will happen. Somebody will take the video and tell, oh, I've deleted it, but it will go into recycle bin. Some will take the video, they will never delete. Sometimes you, the woman, you will take the video and say, oh, don't worry, it's my video. But you don't know how your phone will get missing or how that particular video though, will leak from your phone. So take care of yourself and this is just an advice to Koto Nation. Watch other videos on this channel, tell somebody about Headless. If this story develops, I'll bring you full gist. So yes, kindly subscribe to the channel.